Like any other village of Punjab, Kankur displays many hues of crops. Many farmers dry crops for commercial purpose. Traditionally, the farmers used to dry their produce by open drying. However, the process had its limitations. The products were exposed to dust, insects and birds. I was finding for some solution so that we can preserve the uh, agriculture produce for longer times so that uh, it may not deteriorate. Rajinder Singh came across a technology that had a payback time of about a month only but would take care of all his problems. A research team of Dr. Sukhmeet Singh and three other scientists at Punjab Agricultural University developed an innovative technology, forced circulation solar dryer. It dries agricultural products using solar energy by trapping it inside an advanced greenhouse. The solar dryer has two parts, solar air heater and electric blower. First, the greenhouse naturally heats the air inside. The greenhouse is made of 200 micron UV stabilized transparent plastic sheet. The hot air air to solar air heater that further heats it up. The air from the blower goes to the drying chamber inside which circulates it back to the greenhouse. The temperature reaches up to 65 degrees Celsius. The plant also has a humidity controller to maintain the relative humidity required for the drying process. It takes longer time to dry the product by spreading it in open sun. There is a problem of picking by the birds and addition of birds excreta. These things are there. These things are eliminated in this dryer. Further, it has the advantage like lesser land area requirement. Even in case of rain or thunderstorm, farmer doesn't have to care about it. Some salient features of the solar dryer are better quality product due to lesser exposure to solar radiations, free from dust, birds excreta and dead insects, lesser area required compared to open sun drying, no attention required during off sunshine hours and in case of rain, storm etc, higher shelf life of dried product due to lower final moisture content faster, convenient and energy efficient drying. The dryer is suitable for drying most vegetables and food products such as papad and dalbari. However, it is not advisable to dry grains such as pulses, paddy and maizenil. Tejinder Singh set up this plant at his farmhouse in 2015 at a cost of 1.7 to 1.8 lakh rupees. The plant has a loading and drying capacity of 700 kilograms at a time and it consumes 1 to 1.5 kilowatt of electricity provided by the PV modules. My group leader at four places, they are earning 20,000 rupees per month. Since the solar dryer plant started functioning, the Jinder has been processing several products, packaging and selling them to nearby and outstation markets. Today, he sells more than a thousand packets of branded products in powder form for 200 to 250 rupees each and the unbranded dried ones at 150 rupees per kilogram. He now earns on average 50,000 rupees every month.